So in recent months, we've seen a huge upsurge in anti-Semitism, especially on American campuses. So we're here very close to NYU, New York University, to hear from students and locals in New York City what they think is going on in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. Let's go. So would you say you support more Israel or more Hamas in this conflict? Oh, it's big free Palestine on this side. Yeah. yeah. So you, you support Hamas? Yeah. Okay. Wait, that's... Yes. Okay. Yeah. They are a U.S. designated terrorist organization, and they're controlling the Gaza Strip right now. So that's the that's the one that Israel's fighting against. That Israel's fighting against. Yes. Would you say that you support Israel more, or you support Hamas? Yeah, I'm just gonna go. Do we have to answer? No, no. I'd rather not. Do you think that the majority of Palestinians support some sort of Israeli state in some borders, any borders? Yeah, definitely. I feel like there's there's people that can understand both sides and not be so black and white and find gray areas and things. So actually, statistically, 96% of Palestinians in the West Bank and Gaza don't support Israel in any borders, uh, according to the recent polls, but just for your knowledge. Would you say you support Israel more or you support Hamas? I support the people who suffer, and that is the Palestinian citizen. And would you support a ceasefire before or after hostages are released, or it doesn't matter to you? It doesn't matter. Everything needs to stop now so that people can be on the table and talk to each other. So generally speaking, would you guys say you more support Israel or you support Hamas? Hamas. Hamas. I support Palestine and the genocide that's happening in Gaza. Would you say that you support a free Palestine from the river to the sea? Yes. Yeah. What does from the river to the sea mean to you? What I understand from, from the river to the sea is from all the territory that has been invaded and yeah, killed, brother. not from now, last October, but from back in the day, eight, more than 80 years ago, like all the territory. Do you know who, when, when the state of Palestine was founded originally? Uh, I'm not sure, but... Do you know who the first Palestinian president was? No. I'm not informed about that, no. Would you support a ceasefire before the, the hostages that were kidnapped? Would you support that before they're released? No, like before. From the first moment Israel attacked um, any person, any village from Palestine, should have been stopped. There was a ceasefire on October 6th. You, you're aware of that, yeah? Uh, I wasn't aware of that. So generally speaking, would you say that you are more on the side of Israel or on the side of Hamas? So that's not the correct way to ask because Hamas is the Islamic terrorist group that is supporting not necessarily Palestine. Like, because one thing, I'm Muslim. And I've heard of this like contrast about how Islamic terrorist groups are supporting Palestine. But that's not the case. They're the ones that are also fighting like Israel in support of Palestine, but not in the right way. And I don't think Palestinians or even anyone that is supporting Palestine is interested in the fact that they're doing it through these means. And I don't think we should ever be like supporting one oppressive group versus another. I don't think at all. I think I'm in support of all lives, but when it's all said and done, like Hamas isn't the standing factor for all Palestinian people, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah.